Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Anna and I am a little stuffed up because I think I caught another cold because it's that time of year again. But I wanted to jump on here real quick to do a quick unboxing because I mentioned that I am super excited to be moving on to journal number 101 soon and I wanted to go back to my traveler's notebook but I have this in my hands in my possession and I am so excited to do an unboxing for you um a friend of mine actually recently went to Japan and was very kind enough to help me get a hold of a copy and I am so grateful because uh, that kind of eliminated some of the shipping uh, costs and I it took all of my might not to open this when I got it yesterday at a recent meetup so I am now, just going to open it for you, and we are going to dive right in to see what it looks like. Now, I believe when they first advertised this, um, it was very much with the concept of Thoreau being out in nature, and that really spoke to me. So we've got the instructions or the little uh, description of what is in the packet. This lovely green description <laughs> piece of paper, which I uh, keep of the limited editions. And you probably can't tell, but the band is uh, dark green. So you can kind of tell. Um, it's a gray day here in Washington. And um, but this is actually a little different color too from the um, normal ones that come out because the normal ones are kind of like that yellowy manila color. So this is more of like a stone gray. And it's got the extra band, not a different color, just the dark green. And then this piece right here. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Okay, it comes with a lovely linen bag of which all I keep for, you know, holding craft items. And look at that. It is slightly scratched up already. I don't mind. I love it. And so I have a couple friends at the meetup who do have the olive edition. Um, and you can definitely tell that, uh, and based on fe much of the feedback of uh, people who have done their unboxings here, maybe I'll lower this and you can kind of tell, there you go, that for many, they do not look as olive as people expected. <clears throat> so I don't know if you can tell from the camera, but in this light, it definitely looks very olive -y, a very dark olive. So I'm not sure how it's going to age because usually with leathers, the more oils that you, you know, get on it and the more you use, it does kind of darken. So I'll be curious to see how this darkens and scars up. Now you can definitely tell from the binding here that it's a different color just because of the way it's stretched so from there you can definitely tell the olive color but from like at a glance it kind of looks like just a dark brown now to compare with the other traveler's notebooks here is the brown and then here is the olive now against this light it is very noticeable you can definitely tell that it's not dark brown which I have heard a lot of feedback of saying that some people said theirs did look very much dark brown so I love that I love the green and then here is the camel against the camel you can definitely tell I love it I'm so excited to use this um, I did previously buy 
a dark green leather pen holder to kind of go with it if I wanted to use it. So I've got this right here. So a slightly different color, but that's okay. I love it. And then I also had my friend, Kelly, she is here on YouTube, so I will um, link her channel below, so you should go check her out. Um, I've got these 2018 diary stickers. Um, <clears throat> I haven't opened these up, so I have no idea what they look like. I've never used these before, but she highly recommended it. And... There's the packaging. Look how beautiful they are. Oh, I can't wait to use like, use these. Some alphas. Some tabs. Some sheer dots. And the lovely, lovely train stickers. I love these, they're so pretty. Um, so that's what is going to be coming up soon. And then with this unboxing, um, I did go ahead on my own to kind of get a couple more things because I knew I needed them. Um, I got the craft folder, which I've never used before. I have only ever had like my own handmade one that I used, uh, that I made with craft text paper, which is that very durable stuff that kind of mimics leather. So I did get this for the setup for that. And then I got on Amazon the Olive Pen Loop, which was um, a decent price. So, and I have, um, I'm a Prime member, so I thought, why not? Might as well get it before I can't anymore. And so that will soon go on that. And that's it. That is my Olive Edition unboxing. I'm so excited. That is going to be journal number 101. Let me know if you are interested in a setup. Um, I do know that I'm going to be changing a few things around with this one, especially because I'll be traveling soon, so I will have a, um, I guess, travel setup for that. So, uh, oh, I don't know, just make a comment below if you want to or just like the video um, to let me know, and I will definitely try to get to that because... I am so, so looking forward to using this. It's definitely a stiffer leather too. I can definitely tell from, say, the soft durability of the camel. So, yeah, oh, I'm just, I'm so looking forward to it. Let me know if you guys are using the Olive Edition or maybe you just didn't bother because you already have, um, you know, one that you love using. But, uh, oh, just to give you a quick inside look, that's what the leather is. It's not as, um, how do you describe it? With the camel, look, like this is very kind of like broken up and you can feel the grains of the interior of the leather. This one is very smooth. There's just no broken green at all. Hmm. And then it does come with the, uh, I think it's the 003 insert. So it's just the regular 64 page white paper with the bookmark. So that is it. Let me know in the comments um, what you think about the setup video. I hope you are doing very well. I am soon to do a update video, an update video as well as a, um, a recent haul video because I've done a lot of stress shopping and I have reasons for it so <laughs> more to come um, anyway thank you so much for watching I will see you in my next video bye